I come in with my pal, executive chef, Christian Pritchard. I'm like, what are we doing? He's like, wait. <laughs> He, you know, I, don't know, I don't know anything I, that's going on. I have I've nothing done, that's going on. I've done this a few times, Tim, too. And usually you ask the questions on air. Yeah. <laughs> yes. He's like, stop <laughs> asking questions. We'll do it for the people. Yeah, so, we're going to have fun. People? Okay. Uh, what do you got? Well, it's the new year, right? So mm. everyone's trying, you know, not trying. You're going to do better ways of eating. So you know what I made for you today? Instant polenta. Now ask me all about it what? as I do my job. Watch okay. this. Polenta, it's... it's the fin, it's instant plant as a small form of the corn, so it's fine. And that's why it can cook so fast as opposed to grits. It's Take this. a look there. That's what it is. Yes, it is. Now I'm going to put it out on the board. Look at this, everybody. Everybody. What? Oh, Ooh, come on, help me out. Animal? Help me out. Whoa. Can I hear the control room? Ooh, ah, <laughs> ah. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> now, Tim, what you're going to do is. Like the lovely man you are. I mean, I got salad over there too. See, salad. See, as you know, our good buddy Ted Reader is coming here yeah. too. He calls me Salad Boy. So yeah. I well, it is a very salad. nice looking salad. Ready? Okay, what are you doing? Okay, what spreading are out the planta because this will harden very quickly. This oh, it hardens. This, not not hardens, but, but it will become a little bit more stiff. You know. Now I made an incredible sugo. So tomatoes. I use jardinera of like onions and hot sugo. peppers. It's just it's a, sauce. a sauce. Come on. It's a sauce. Okay. Call it a sauce. As my wife always says, she goes, "You work in Italian, but remember, Christian, we are English." <laughs> She's like, stop, sugo. You know? <laughs> Do you really see, you know? So here we go. Every, again, I need everybody's, like, look at this. It looks like meat, but the meatiness is from the mushroom. Look oh, at so this. there's no meat in there. That's just that. Oh, no, wow. and what I want you to do, and everybody, that smells this great. is ancient Italian food from the north. In fact, a lot of people in the north of Italy are called the polenti, meaning like the, the corn eaters. I was there last. This is yeah. kind of like a Milan, that kind of area yeah. in, yeah. All, um, all in Barolo, Barolo Barbaresco. Yeah. Kind Tuscan, of in that exactly. Okay. Now, I'm going to bring a little Tuscan in here. So you've got, this is like Tuscan beans. Okay, so it's, you know, garlic, some, um, uh, I do mixed beans. We could do chickpeas. We could do... Uh, cannellini, which are white kidney. Look at this. Wow. So this is instant goodness. Now, I, I just love this. And the idea is you put this on your table. This is the way the Italians do it. And you, you know, I, they would eat right off the table. We can take it out. Now, a okay. little bit of oil. Olive oil, okay. Timmy, I need some cheese stuff. on there, sir. Cheese. What do we yeah. got? Uh, Parmigiano. Parmigiano Reggiano. Like, folks, here's the Come thing. On. You can use some old, old cheddar, but you no, want to no, do it no. that Parmigiano way. Reggiano. You're the salt factor, right? Look at that, Tim. Nice job. Mm -hmm. How's it look, everybody? Now, mm -hmm. some freshly cut parsley, Italian parsley. Oh, okay. Wow. Isn't that amazing? And so you do this. We've got the oil on there. So what I want you to do now, Tim, is we're going to take this. Grab a, a, a plate there. Plate. How easy was this? And I mean it. I mean literally easy. And I want you to see, I put it the uh, polenta in a container so I can drop it in while you're like this in the water. You could use milk, you could do some cheese, but water's just fine. Now watch this. In, in a few minutes, if we had it, it hardens a little bit more, but you're gonna do this, right, right on your plate. Right on the plate. Right on your plate like this. So you could put this in the middle, let's say in the middle of the dining table, and then everybody can help themselves? And anyone who's seen me do this, you're gonna think I'm nuts. I've done ones as big as this whole bar. And then the Italians will have, we, being Canadians, we're fun, they have their own paddles to move it all down the board. I use a hockey stick. <laughs> And you know what? All of my, that's, that's great. What about a guitar? Look at this little guitar. Huh? <laughs> How good is that? It's huh? my spatula tar. How many guitars you got at home? Two many. A couple. What do you think? What do you, do you want the insurance people to be watching? <laughs> come on. <laughs> I got three. Look at the spatula. Yeah. Okay. So a little bit of, come on, Tim. Here you go. This, your whole crew is going to be great. I, I was saying that. because it's so nice when somebody else makes a salad. Why is that, Christian? If somebody else is making a salad, we were just, it's, yeah. it's so much taste. No, when we were just talking about that, Tim, and the funny thing I think it is, is that you see a pilot, it's really easy. The components of that are great greens, right. some balsamic reduction, cheese, some apple, you know, yeah. orange zest. You got a little, little, little orange zest. Throw orange, orange zest little, on there little, because little you're, you're giving a parallel taste to everything too, right? Okay. How simple is this? Like seriously, okay. go for I'm going, it. I'm going in. Get okay. nervous now. Huh? Is he gonna like it, folks? <laughs> and you know what? Being down here in Hamilton, Niagara, the people they know this. Yes. Good. Awesome. Good. See, that's like, what you know what I like too. I like how there's no meat in there. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like yeah. I, I am a meat, the heavy meat eater, Me too. but if you can come up with some alternatives to not having right. to meat. Well, you know what? The great okay. thing is in the summer, grilled veg or anything. You oh, can and it's any... got a little spice to it, too. Yeah, little yeah. Some... It's a little sneaky. It comes up and gets you. I know. Ah, it comes up and gets you. Okay, that's, that's the our way I show. work. That's our show. I'm a little spicy at the a end, little, too. A little spicy. All right. Get it, Richard. <laughs> All right, bye.